Hey guys, and welcome to Car Guy 1999 Reviews. Today, thanks to Infinity of Nashua, we have the 2016 Lincoln MKZ. Link to this exact car will be in the description below. This car is actively for sale at time of filming, though it's not going to last long because this thing only has 28,000 miles on it. This is the two liter EcoBoost all wheel drive. Push a button here, opens the trunk, plenty of room. Oh, there it is. Been looking for that all weekend. Absolutely magnificent condition. was owned by customers very local to the dealership ah there it is so they didn't drive it a ton obviously no nope. let's see if it's in here i think i looked for it before with no luck but it's worth a second shot. Oh, obviously all your manuals, books, not in there. Stay. One thing, took a little bit of getting used to it. Used to it. I'm now used to it. I've had this car for I think two days total. Um, so obviously the push button shifter. You have race mode, reverse neutral drive and to activate sport mode you hit sport on the shifter sunglasses holder sunroof all that fun stuff without further ado Like I said, I've had this car, took it Saturday night, it's now Monday morning, um, so it's been in my possession for two days. I'm impressed with it. It's a nice car to spend time with. And obviously, come the winter season, it's all wheel drive. You're not gonna have to really worry about snow. Yeah, ground clearances might be a little bit of an issue, but whatever. It's extremely comfortable for longer journeys. I'm very well impressed with this car. I want to say it's a six speed automatic. At least it feels like it. I never actually counted the gear ratios. Um, but with this EcoBoost bringing a very um, flat torque curve across the rev, brand, rev range. I think it's, yeah, it's a six speed auto. This is honestly a really, really comfortable car. The interior is in great shape. These, these previous owners took very, very good care of it. Do believe you could get an even faster one of these I think they offered these with a v6 eco boost uh, at least in the higher terminals I'm not sure if that was the case in 2016 but I know I've driven one of these with a v6 twin turbo um, same basic platform and car as the Ford Fusion Sport I mean yeah you can definitely tell the Fusion DNA in this. It drives very similar to a Fusion. It's not 
like, oh, I'll get into a Fusion, but oh yeah, this is just like the Lincoln MKZ. They do enough to differentiate it. Um, but with that being said, you're gonna tell this is based on a Fusion platform. Oh, this is a good car. I mean, I, I can't, I don't, I don't think this is a high trim level. I think this is relatively entry level. I can't really find too many things that I'm like, oh God, I need to change this. It's a good overall package. It's a nice car to spend time with. I've not said, all right, get me out of this thing. Um, I do wish I had cooled seats, but I believe that was optional on these. Um, but, I think overall you really can't go too wrong. This one's going to have um, a six month, 6,000 mile powertrain warranty on it that we put on it. But thank you guys so much for watching. Please like, share, subscribe. See y'all in the next one.